Look at the result, meat post today, the ones I made. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to Linda's channel. Uh, by the way, my meatball has finished. Um, the one I made before, two months ago, it's finished. So I have to do it again today, right? And the forecast uh, cloudy and rained. So uh, the best is to have a, a meatball soup with um, noodles, right? And um, for you guys, the ones uh, uh, haven't subscribed yet, don't forget subscribe, like, and comment <laughs> to encourage me more to make more video for the features. So if i found my subscriber even just increase one person it's give me a feeling like oh my god i got more subscriber like give me a feeling good you know uh, to encourage me like i'm more uh, excited to make more videos so i hope you guys t stay tuned Okay guys, what I got here for my meatballs, right, is <coughs> 750 grams uh, of minced beef, uh, 200 grams of uh, cornstarch, and I got 2 teaspoons of uh, white pepper, uh, half teaspoon of uh, bicarbonate soda, Two teaspoon of salt, one tablespoon of uh, garlic, fried garlic, and three tablespoon of uh, dried onion, and I got ice water here, right? So because normally people make uh, meatballs, they use the you know like a use blender to blend the uh, use the ice cubes put together with the minced beef and to blend it but I don't have blender so I just use ice water right so let me start what do you think guys that is the weather it's very cloudy okay now I have to add salt uh, white pepper uh, bicarbonate soda or baking powder uh, I have to add dried onion garlic <coughs> oh my god Peppers always make me sneezing. Right. And I have to add cornstarch. Oh yeah guys, I forgot to mention use the beef cubes as well. Two beef cubes. To give um, taste to the uh, meatballs. Add a little bit of water. And again.
Okay. And I have to add more the finish the tapioca. Little bit water. of water guys but maybe I need a little bit more cubes a beef cubes Take a little bit more water Like I say guys, like I don't have a blender, right? I just use the hand to mix all everything together and then I start to uh, put in a pan. Okay guys, sorry, I have to add again for the white eggs, two white eggs I used, right, and mix it again. I use my machine. Easy. It's ready. The water starts boiling, so I start straight away. Let's have a look. Let's 
sorry. Yeah. Now I'm start to make it close, put in a pan because the water is uh, boiling. So I start to Like this, guys, that's it easy to make like a balls. Okay, guys, I use the two eggs to cover with the meatballs so. David doesn't know about this, right? So I start to do it. Hopefully it's okay. Oh my god. Surprise meatballs. Yeah guys, my meatballs start to floating on the top of the water and just slow heat to put in a cooker so it's a cook slowly and after that all of the floating on the top here and I have to take out put in a cold water. So now I have to take out the ones on the top here put in a cold water. I just move it here. Here's the meatball in a cold water now. 
ده اسا قلتون and after that I have drained it the meat balls from the water leave it for a while and then put in a bag and then take to the freezer here's my meat balls and I drained the water now ready to go to the bag and then go to the freezer so let me to put them on the bag okay so I don't know how many in the five Forty maybe. Five. Five. Oh wow. So all together we had the small one too, right? And all together forty four. Mm. Okay, that's it. You can put me. Me. Look at you guys. This is sur surprise, David. He will find out what inside. <laughs> Huge. Here, guys, my noodles ready. Look at the meatballs. Boom. Look at this. Oh my God, David's shocked when he look at the big meatballs like this. The huge meatballs. And I have to put the bottom bowl and then I put the noodles and meatballs on the top. Time to dish the noodles, meatball soup. Ready for noodles? Breakfast? Have you seen this, folks? You recorded. Have you seen this? Look, it looks like a, a is, rock a from shock. a volcano. It is a huge surprise, shock when you see my meatballs. They are huge. Yeah, massive meatballs. Nice. Nice. And now I have to put the huge meatballs. And then egg go to there and I have to add a little bit dry onion on the top right I 
Um, yeah, guys, look at the result. Meat post today, the ones I made. So, it's a leftover mix, don't have it? This is the huge one, the normal one, egg. Ooh. We got the Jolly yes. Green Giant coming to the house. Lovely, gorgeous. Jolly baby egg, a chicken inside. <laughs> Yes, very good. Go on. Here, yeah, guys, that is my large meatballs. Egg inside it. Nice surprise. <laughs> so, David Shock, when he found Meat. out the eggs inside the meatball. Yeah, meatball Scott's egg. That's why I ever mentioned as a uh, Scott's egg, you can make it by yourself. So, today I made it by myself. That's the result. Okay guys, now let me start to enjoy my meatballs soup, right? So, thank you so much for you guys, the ones are watching and I really appreciate it. But the huge meatballs is a shock, damn it. So, <laughs> you didn't expect. He didn't expect that the heat was <laughs> never seen in his life, okay? Mm. Mm. So lovely. Mm. And I got ketchup. What's that? Hot chili sauce, obviously. ABC. And ketchup man is ABC. Right. And hot ghost chili. This is really spicy. Mm. Yeah. Nice? Yeah. No. It's better than the one before. Yeah. Really nice. Yay! Practice makes perfect. Yeah, practice makes perfect. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.